Hey hey everybody, this is Larry, this is me going over Q1 of the recent weekly contest 216, check if two strings arrays are equivalent. So this, I hope this didn't give you trouble, but if you just want to, um, you know, see how I did it, uh, you know, you could check it out. It is a little bit weird in that, you know, it, it is a very straightforward problem, I don't think there's any uh, question about it. Um, in certain language, in theory, maybe you want string buffers instead of string concatenation, but in this case, it doesn't really matter. All you have to do is just concatenate the strings, the left and the right, or the word one and word two, and then see if they're the same. Um, in theory, it's n squared time ish, uh, but you know the sum is pretty okay. So the the constraints are small enough that it doesn't matter. Uh, so this is how I did it. Uh, I did it during the contest in about thirty seconds. So eh, but uh, yeah. You can also just write it out with four loops. I think it's okay. And then just compare them at the end. Uh, hope you enjoyed this video. It was very short. I, you know, it's, I don't know why you're here to be honest now, other than the support, which I appreciate. But uh, but you can watch me suffer live during the contest now, since it's only 30 seconds long. <laughs> Uh, thanks for watching. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me in Discord. Let me know if you have any questions because I will always listen to questions. Um, it allows me to, you know, explain future prompts as well when I realize what people are asking and thinking about. Anyway, I will see y'all next week, next contest, next problem, wherever you are. Bye-bye.